what is a session replication? Session replication is a technique used in distributed systems to ensure that user session data is constantly available across multiple servers in a cluster. This is crucial for maintaining session continuity and state in case a server fails or if, or if um, load balancing is used to distribute user requests across multiple servers. Session replication helps achieving high availability, reliability, and scalability in web applications. Let's talk about how session um, replication works. So let's start from here. First, let's just put list numbers. No, 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 not like that. And numbers, exactly. The first thing that I will talk about will be the in-memory replication. Okay. So first, session replication involves copying session data from one server to another servers within the cluster. Uh, this can be done by several ways. The first one is in-memory replication. Session data is stored in memory of each server and replicated to other servers in real time or near real time. This approach is fast but can consume a lot of memory and bandwidth. Number two, we have database backup replication. Uh, database backed replication. Uh, so session data is stored in a shared database that that all servers can access. When a server updates session data, the changes are written uh, to the database, ensuring all servers see the uh, the latest state. Number three, we have distributing caching. Session data is stored in distributed cache, Redis or Memcache, that is accessible by all servers. This approach balances speed and resource usage. And number four, we have file-based replication. So session data is written to shared file system or network attached to, uh, storage, which all servers can access. This method is less common due to pot uh, potential performance issue. Let's talk about the benefits of uh, session replication. The first thing will be high availability. The first thing will be high availability. So ensure that session data is not lost in a server fails or uh, other servers can continue to provide service using the replicated session data. Uh, we have load balancing number two. Um, allows user requests to be distributed across multiple servers without losing session continuity. User, users can interact with any server in the cluster while maintaining their session state. Number three, we have a fault tolerance. What is this? We have fault tolerance. So enhances fault tolerance by replicating uh, session data across multiple servers reducing uh, the risk of data loss. And number four, which will be uh, scalability. So supports horizontal scaling by allowing new servers to be added to the, cl uh, to the cluster without dis uh, dis uh, dis uh, dis disrupting user session. Let's talk about the challenges of the session replication. The first thing that we'll talk about will be the performance overhead. Replicating session data across servers can introduce performance overhead, particularly in high traffic applications. Number two, consistency. Uh, ensuring data consistency across all servers can be challenging, especially in cases of network latency or partitioning. Number three, we have resource usage. So in memory replica replication can consume significant memory and network bandwidth, while database-backed replication can introduce latency. 
And lastly, complexity, implementing and managing session replication adds complexity to the system architecture. Um, so, in conclusion, session replication is essential for managing, maintaining session continuity, high availability, and fault tolerance in distributed web applications. By replicating sessions that are across multiple servers, applications can ensure that users do not lose their session state in case of server failures or during load balancing. While it introduces some performance and complexities uh, challenges and complexity challenges, the benefits of increased reliability and scalability make session replication a valuable technique for robust application design. So that's it for this video and see you in the future.